Hello friends, welcome to Data Science Lovers. In this video, we will see how to combine data from different columns into a new column. Here I have a sample data set that I have already imported in my Jupyter Notebook. In this data set, you can see there are three columns, name, city and country. And there are five records or you can say five rows for the reference purpose only here. Now I want to combine the data from these three columns and create a new column here means I want to create a fourth column with the combination of data or details from these three columns. So how I can do this to create a new column our syntax always our data frame name which is data here then square brackets and quotes marks and in the quotes marks we have to write our new column name. I am writing new here only. So this is the syntax to create a new column always. Our data frame name and our new column name. Now in this column what I want, I want the values or data from these three columns. So first of all I will consider this column. How to consider a column? My data frame name again and in the square brackets the column name. So this syntax will consider this name column. Okay. With this, I want to add the values from second and third column also. So I will write like this data city plus data and my third column country. Here we have to write the plus sign. Now, if I run this and I have a look at my data now then you can see a new column has been added here which contains the values from these three columns we cannot understand the details of this new added column clearly there are no comma or no space or no underscore between the values so we can add the underscore or space also like this i will create a new column again new one Earlier it was new, now it is new one equal to again my first column which is name plus I will add a space here quote marks and between the quote marks I have to give a space this is the space now I will consider my second column city and again I will consider the space and the last column. Now if you see I have created a one more column new one consider first column name plus the space then second column and after second column again space and at last my third column. Now if I run this the command has been successfully run and to see my data like this. So a new column, new one has been added and now if you see there are spaces between the values of the first, second and third columns like this. This is the space that is shown here. Now instead of this space here, we can consider other things also like comma or underscore or hyphen. I will copy this syntax again. Now I will create a one more column, new two. In this new two column, Instead of space, I will first give comma here and at second, I will give underscore. Now, if I run this, the command has been run and if you have a look at this data, then a new column has been added where after the values of first column, we have comma now and after the value of second column, then we have underscore now means from this we have underscore and from this we have comma. So we can do like this also. Now we can clearly understand that this name Niharika is from Delhi city and the country is India here. Similarly Singh is from Toronto city and the country is Canada here. So that's how we can add uh, new columns in our data frame with the combination of the values from our existing columns. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to Data Science Lovers.